Michelle Branch arrested for assault amid split from husband Patrick Carney of Black Keys singer Michelle Branch was arrested Thursday at her Nashville home on a misdemeanor assault charge on the heels of splitting from her husband, Patrick Carney of the Black Keys. She spent almost eight hours in jail before being released on $1,000 bail. According to the arrest affidavit, Metro Nashville Police Department officers responded to the couple's home just after 2 a.m. for a report of a possible domestic disturbance. Branch, 39, told police she and her husband are having marital problems and said she slapped Carney in the face once or twice during an argument, according to the affidavit. Carney had no visible injuries, an officer wrote in the report. In a separate interview with officers, Carney told police his wife slapped him. Branch was booked into jail at 4.30 a.m. on a misdemeanor domestic assault charge, online records show, and was released just before noon representatives for Branch did not immediately respond to USA Today for comment regarding her arrest. Police arrested Branch on the same day the singer confirmed to USA Today she split from Carney. The Everywhere singer-songwriter married the rock drummer in April 2019. They share two children, one who is an infant. To say that I am totally devastated doesn't even come close to describing how I feel for myself and for my family. The rug has been completely pulled from underneath me and now I must figure out how to move forward, Branch wrote in a statement released to USA Today Thursday night. With such small children, I ask for privacy and kindness. Court documents show Branch is slated to appear in court November 7 for a settlement. Previously, Michelle Branch announces she's pregnant months after miscarriage contributing. Matthew Limekuller, the Tennessean Natalie Nasa Allen covers trending news for USA Today. Reach her at Noland at usatoday.com and follow her on Twitter at Natalie A. Lund. Reach Tennessean reporter Molly Davis at mdavis2 at gannett.com or on Twitter.